To help encourage a new generation into the science sector, each year the Chemical Industries Association champion a young ambassador at the early stage of their career. We went to meet this year's young ambassador to find out what the role involves. Callum Wheatley is something of a superstar in the chemical industry. Has anyone heard of Sabic before? Ooh, a few hands. At just 26, Hallam has been crowned the Chemical Industry Association's Young Ambassador, awarded to someone outstanding who shows real leadership and a passion for promoting careers in the STEM subjects. I was absolutely shocked and, and delighted. You know, it's such a personal achievement for myself, you know, but I think the award is more than just the title. Um, I think working with the chemical industry over the next year to, to showcase just the, the types of careers and the, and the versatility that we have and the exciting projects that we're working on. Um, but I want to showcase to, to youngsters that you don't need to be a scientist or an engineer to work within the chemical industry. And I'm hoping this year we can really showcase that to young people. This reaction here is the dimerization of butadiene. Hallam is a research chemist. He's been working at Sabic, a global chemical company on Teesside, for five years. His employer is also supporting Hallam to study part-time for a chemistry degree at Teesside University. Hallam is a phenomenal ambassador, both for Sabic and for the chemical industry at large. He works tirelessly, locally and nationally, going into schools, talking to young people and encourage them to follow careers in a STEM subject. Fantastic. The most rewarding aspect for the local lad from Saltburn is inspiring the next generation of young scientists in schools right across the UK and right here on his doorstep in Redcar. Hallam says this is absolutely hands down the best thing about his ambassadorial role, talking to children and other young people who may in 20 years time be doing his job. I love science as one of my subjects in school so it is really fun and it's very interesting to see how someone's actually came in and spoke to us about it and it's just, it's just a really fun subject. Uh, I think a career in the science would be very interesting because of what Hallam does in science it, with Savick. I would like it because you would get to solve problems and then you would know the answer to stuff. It's incredibly important that people like Hallam come in and um, speak to children, even from as young as primary school. Um, it makes them aware of potential career opportunities that are out there and allows them to see routes into the various different careers in the STEM industry and hopefully will inspire them to look to those type of careers in the future. According to the boss, nurturing the next generation is integral to securing the industry's future. The Young Ambassador Award and then the ongoing Future Forum Network is crucial for our industry. We want to attract and retain young people, whether they're apprentices, chemists, chemical engineers, they can come by a legal route, HR, finance. It's important that we attract people, give them an opportunity early on in their career to take decisions, work with each other, develop and learn, and become our future leaders. Anyone considering a career in a, in a STEM subject has to consider the chemical industry. It's such a broad and diverse kind of industry. There's so many different types of roles, and it's an industry that has given me so much. Back in the lab, Hallam is working on a mixed plastic waste project and investigating hydrogen as a low carbon transport fuel. And with his rock star reception, it's hoped Hallam is inspiring a new generation to be part of an exciting future in the chemical industry.